Hi guys, hope you're all okay. Oh, I'm looking a little bit windswept. Uh, this morning I have been out uh, with for lunch with uh, one of my girlfriends and we took Ruben and we went to Hobbycraft and Dunelm and had lunch at Dunelm, which was very nice. Got back, Ruben fell asleep in the car and stayed asleep. So I'm taking this opportunity to record the whole video. So my makeup was done hours ago and I've eaten a cream tea since then. So yeah, but I'm using the peace and quiet while I've got it. So only one bag from each. So hobby craft. I got some stickers. Uh, what are these called? Chipboard stickers. I just like the colours on the lettering. Um, I'm going to use some of them in my bullet journal, and then probably let Ruben have the others. But I just thought the like the colours were cute. I like them. I don't think they were very expensive. Um, and then I picked up some of these, these were like £1.50, they were quite cheap, like, so the LED tea lights, but the taller ones, um, I think they work better, like, I like the little ones, but I think the taller ones work better on some of the, uh, like, jars and candle things I've got, these were on offer, I think they were like £1.50 for the three, um, Oh, Reuben, these were like a quid, I think. Reuben saw these and was obsessed because the eyes move on the panda. Uh, but yeah, the kid loves stickers, what can I say? Hello, Darwin. There's a little Darwin nose. Hi. Hi, buddy. Do you like the stickers? <laughs> we didn't get anything for you, I'm afraid. Nothing for Darwin. Um, oh. This looked good. I've not tried these before. Oh. <laughs> it isn't a toddler, it's a dog. What can I say? Um, so these are baked, I think the brand's called Baked In, and it's chocolate cookie mug baking mix, three individual portions, uh, ready in 45 seconds. Worth a go. They might be hideous, but they might be amazing. So yeah, I've got that. And then Reuben, Reuben is very good at holding a toy, having a look at it, a, a little play and then putting it back. Um, and he did that with quite a few of the toys there, because I must admit I do think some of the toys are quite pricey in Hobbycraft. Like a lot of the crafting stuff is really good, but some of the, like there was this tiny tractor and it was £8 and it was like in another shop it would have been 3 so I'm like, hmm. Uh, but then in the cake making section, there were these like dinosaur cupcake toppers and he would not put them back. So they came home with us. I didn't even think he realises they're edible. But yeah, they're like little dinosaurs to go on cupcakes. Um, oh, and then again for the bullet journal. I did pick up this other very beautiful floral thing and then I realised it was £12 and it was like it was just a big sticker with these like paper flowers on so I was like this in my brain was like second choice but this was like a lot cheaper but yeah I just thought they were pretty little paper flowers to go in the bullet journal that no one will ever see but I enjoy quite a lot and then the Dunelm bag picked up a new oven tray. I like the Dunelm ones, the basic ones that are like £1.50. They're so good um, and they really are non-stick. The only gutting thing is they do a giant square one which you fit so much stuff on but it's actually too big for my oven and I've bought them twice forgetting that it's too big for my oven. Um, but yeah, I like their, I like their baking trays. Um, I bought two tea towels. I'm officially old. Um, the first one is just chickens. Um, because I freaking love a chicken. Uh, they had so many cute like chicken plates and chicken cups. And I'm like, 
and then I like held this plate set for a bit and I'm like no because I kind of made a thing last year that I was only going to buy Emma Bridgewater or Cornish Blue and White like plates and bowls and things um, but I do like chickens but I was like no I put it back so I bought the chicken tea towel as a kind of a compromise with myself and then obviously the coronation was a, a while ago now and I did get a coronation tea towel with King Charles on um, but these were reduced and they are beautiful it's like in celebration of the coronation of King Charles um, and they're just nice big and useful tea towels um, I think originally they were £3.50 but I'm quite sure they were half price they were reduced because obviously I say the coronation was a while ago but I do like the Dale Nelm tea towels they're huge um, and then Scarlett picked up some method anti-back all purpose wild rhubarb cleaner so I picked it up as well because it does smell lush and it does a lovely job and then I picked up a load of these mini daffodil no they're not daffodils mini sunflower picks um my last hobby craft haul i did online and um i've got a bit of quite a bit of sunflowers there and even though this was from donnell not hobby craft i was like when i saw them i was like like i thought they would look nice in our reef that i have on the front door that i kind of try and change up somewhat seasonally they currently still have union jack flags in from the coronation but i thought i could put those in there and they'd look nice maybe um it says they were one pound fifty but they were on offer for a quid so i got four i basically picked up all the sunflower ones um <clears throat> i got one of these uh collapsible silicon containers they're always useful um like unless you you know in case you don't know what collapsible means they're always somewhat useful I tend to take things like this when I go out for lunch with Ruben because sometimes he eats everything and sometimes he doesn't and if you've spent a lot of money on a meal and you kind of think well he's not going to eat rest of that but I can bring the protein aspect of it home and the dogs might eat it or if there's like sometimes Reuben's favourite thing is normally mac and cheese and if they don't have it on the child's menu we buy the adult portion and then it's like it can come home do you know what I mean they're just useful things to always have in a bag or kept, we normally keep one in the car but I've not got one this size so I thought that would be good and then um, I couldn't leave these behind. I don't tend to use paper casings um, that often, but I quite like the little floral cupcake picks. And these were reduced. They were originally two pound fifty, then was one pound twenty five, and now sixty two p. And I I'd have paid that for the cupcake picks because they're cute for when we do these little tea parties. And then. I knew there was another thing. I got one of these small little um, fragrance diffusers. Lasts up to three weeks in the scent rhubarb for one pound fifty. Reminds me of the ones I used to be able to get in Primark. Not to be fair, I can't remember the last time I went to a Primark, but I used to buy them quite regularly from Primark, and they're very similar package to that. I'm sure they were only a pound or a pound fifty, but yeah, I got that, and that is my hobby craft and Dan Elm. Ooh. right I got through the video Ruben is still asleep let's see if I can get this put away and drink a brew before he wakes up let's see if I'm that lucky fingers crossed uh, I hope you enjoyed the video guys take care talk to you in the next one